In tonight's Education Watch 10, new developments regarding the I-STEP exam. The Indiana Legislature approved a bill yesterday calling to revoke the troubled test. News 10's Melissa Crash tells us what this means for local schools. The I-STEP exam has been surrounded by controversy for the past few years, like glitches and scoring errors. But yesterday, a major decision was made for the future of the exam. Under this measure, it would scrap the I-STEP test and create a committee to study what should replace it. The federal government reauthorized No Child Left Behind into the Every Student Succeeds Act. And what that will do is that will continue testing for all states, all school corporations. The House approved the measure on a 77-19 vote, an important vote that Karen Goler says is a step in the right direction. I think that's partly um, a result of the controversy that we've had surrounding ISTEP and some of the problems we've had. School officials say it will be another two years until we could see any changes. That's due to the current vendor agreement. And I think there is a positive that's come out of this in that it's going to cause us to take a more focused look at our testing. Giving educators hope for what lies ahead for standardized testing in the Hoosier State. To find a better test or a set of tests that will help give parents and families better information about how students are doing in language arts, math, and science. The approved measure now heads to Governor Mike Pence for the final decision. Reporting in Terre Haute, Melissa Crash, News 10. The bill also focuses on test scores. They would have to be released in a timely manner. Under this bill, scores would have to be reported by July.